How's it going crew? This is Happy Days and welcome to another Terraria tutorial. In this episode we're going to be looking at the hell biome and we're in more detail we're going to be looking at how to farm effectively in the hell biome because I don't know about you guys but I actually find it pretty annoying to be running around down here. There's lava everywhere, there's the voodoo dolls and there's I don't know, they're all immune to lava and it's just annoying. So I'm going to look at setting up a really easy farm that can get you lots of this good loot. This is a hard mode farm and uh, yeah, it's going to get you a heap of stuff and get you guide voodoo dolls so you can farm the wall of flesh at your leisure. Stay watching and I'll show you how. Okay, welcome back crew. So here's the farm in operation. And one of the biggest things I was thinking about when making this farm and just trying a few different things was that there's quite a few flying enemies in the hell biome, especially in hard mode. So we've gone with uh, some sloped uh, ramps up and down and you just use any sort of hammer to hammer the blocks. And basically the point of that is mobs, slimes, bats, they all fly up, fly up into it. And oh, here comes a voodoo demon now. And drops the guide right on top of me. Beautiful. Love it. Okay, looking in the loot chest, I've been collecting a few voodoo dolls while this farm's been running. So that's pretty fun. I'll add another one now. And also, it collects a fair bit of interesting hell biome loot. The thing I really like is you get the unholy tridents, which is kind of fun. Uh, a few banners, you get the fire feathers, so you can actually make uh, flame wings, which is kind of cool, they're pretty useful. You get the living fire blocks, which is a really nice effect. Uh, yeah, it's, it's kind of cool and I wouldn't mind building a few things out of it actually. It's an interesting build type and that can drop from any uh, hard mode mob. You get the obsidian rose, which gives you some defense against lava and all that good stuff. So you can pause and have a quick look if you'd like. Alright, so let's chuck the wiring up guys. There's not too much to this trap. Um, basically, you just got a teleporter leading in. And you can see I've rigged up a couple of dart traps around here. And I'll just get out of the trap and have a look around. The reason for this is that the flame imps occasionally uh, land here. And they're stationary mobs, so they don't move. They just teleport. And the problem with them is that they can shoot through blocks too. So... If you didn't kill them, eventually they would build up in your trap and really cause you some headaches. We've also got some actuated spears here and they're just firing. So they're the main way mobs are dying in this trap, especially because lava, most mobs are immune to lava in here. And just got a uh, bat trigger up there, just triggering all the one second timers. So it's actually not difficult to make trap this. It's like a giant version of a pirate farm or uh, a solar eclipse farm, just a lot bigger. So I'm just doing a gauntlet run through there. So back in the trap, and uh, yeah, and you'd pretty much just leave this running uh, while you, you know, watching a bit of TV, playing on your iPad, whatever works. And yeah, collect a few voodoo dolls, collect some of this loot, as I was saying. Um, make it out of bricks in case corruption or hello gets down to your hell biome. And yeah, I've just got a water candle set up there and you can hold a second one in your hand to get some additional spawning. Uh, probably took about mm, half an hour or so to get all this stuff, maybe 40 minutes, so it's pretty quick. Uh, oh, there's another banner, awesome. And uh, yeah, the mobs, uh, the spawn rates are pretty high. If you only wanted to get voodoo dolls, then by all means do it on a pre-hard mode world. And you could use regular dart traps um, or take some hard mode traps to a pre-hard mode world. All right, uh, last thing. Someone's asked me for a shout out and I've been doing a couple of those on Australia type shout outs. So Grafindo Rasengan Fatality, cool name by the way, has asked me to say, I shall wiggle your puffs. So that sounds <laughs> really weird. But uh, hey, I said I'd say out anything. So there you go. Alright guys, thanks for watching as always. If you've got any questions about this trap, just leave a comment. Uh, likes are always appreciated. And also is subscribing if you haven't joined us yet. Thanks to all the new people. We need to do another giveaway. Let's get it happening. Uh, do a giveaway within the next day or so. So get excited for that. Alright crew, stay happy. This is Happy Day signing out. 
And um, have a nice day or night. Bye.